there a way we can do something like that uh, by injection inside or or almost a cleaning. Supposing we hit the body with a tremendous, uh, whether it's ultraviolet or just very powerful light, and I think you said that hasn't been checked, but you're going to test it. And then I said, supposing you brought the light inside the body, you can, which you can do either through the skin or uh, in some other way. And I think you said you're going to test that, too. Sounds interesting. We'll the right, folks who could. right. And then I see the disinfectant, where it knocks it out in a minute, one minute. And is there a way we can do something like that uh, by injection inside or, or almost a cleaning? Because you see it gets on the lungs and it does a tremendous number of the lungs. So it would be interesting to check that. So that you're going to have to use medical doctors with. But it sounds, it sounds interesting to me. Here we go. The new, the new headline is Trump asks people to go outside. That's dangerous. Here we go. Same old group. Uh, you ready? I hope people enjoy the sun. And if it has an impact, that's great. I'm just hearing this, not really for the first time. I mean, there's been a rumor that, you know, a very nice rumor that you go outside in the sun or you have heat and it does have an effect on other viruses. But now we get it from one of the great laboratories of the world, I have to say. It covers a lot more territory than just this. This is, this is probably an easy thing, relatively speaking, for you. I would like you to speak to the medical doctors to see if there's any way that you can apply light and heat to cure.